So I wrapped up this conference, it's called Planner Get Slaughtered, and I took a couple days where I buried myself in ideas and plans about my future, and with the future with the company, in 2022, 2023, and beyond. And what I really, I, I came to a conclusion that it, you know, it's not always about growth. In volatile markets or in, in any growth stage of a business, you don't always have to keep growing. I, I think it's almost perceived like business porn, where it's like it's bigger, bigger, better, better. You don't have to do that in business. You know, that in the social media world sometimes promotes that. But what really I think is important is obviously profitability, but it's sustainable growth. And not only sustainable to the business, but to your own lifestyle. So for me, I came up with really clear goals around exactly where I want to go with, with my company and my personal investment and with my team so that we have a, an achievable goal each year where right now at 2022 we have 2 million square feet under ownership in our storage portfolio I want to grow a million square feet each year for the next three to five years and, and possibly into the decade so next year we have 3 million square feet then we have 4 million square feet the following year and meet our goal of 5 million square feet and and this is sustainable and this is real and this is something that we can all get around it's it's measurable so everyone knows this is the expectation to the company and then also in our company we don't want to be over levered like we debt can be a double-edged sword where if you have too much debt you can really get hurt and it can crush your whole portfolio crush your investments debt is very important to get returns and it can accelerate returns quickly but you got to be cautious with how you use it so we want to make sure that there's only 50 percent of debt on all our assets you can't be too levered in a bad economy so the last goal i want is to have my management companies with all-purpose storage and patriot properties management profitable so it takes a lot of talent to go out there and find good real estate deals to make sure all the accounting's in place so all the investors get their reporting done on time and all the bills get paid on time and we have to have operations where we provide great customer service and we provide our tenants with safe clean affordable places to live like these things take a lot of people and that's where in the operations where the money is made but if you don't invest in the people you don't train them you don't measure their performance you don't incentivize them with benefits and bonuses for working with the company then you're never going to build this team that can actually execute on the vision and provide superior returns and customer service and a really quality brand so this is what i want to focus on is scaling back like next year it's not about just growth it's not about more investors it's not about more revenue or more deals or, or selling more deals it's, it's about profitability it's about sustainable growth it's about building the all-purpose storage brand to have high quality customer service and be efficient where our expenses are low so one strategy that we have is we are building up our call center it is very important to the growth of our company and the storage industry so storage has changed right now there are all these suburban and tertiary markets these facilities that are out in the suburbs that can't afford to pay a full-time manager and right now the industry is shifting where technology and a call center with foreign labor where some of our call center employees live in the philippines they're able to provide exceptional customer service and still keep a low cost on the investment and this drives returns and profits to our investors but it takes operational excellence we have to execute where we provide our customers the best quality service it's prompt it's timely and as we grow and we have 15,000 units under management now and we'll have 20,000 by next spring it's hard to make sure that we provide great service for all those customers but this is what we're able to do with technology with a good management structure with good team leaders with experienced people that are from the storage industry that we're hiring focus on our edge and our edge is this remote management model through a customer service you know customer centric platform with a call center that is the next evolution of the industry and where we are going to get great at so that we differentiate ourselves from all the other operators